welcome back hopefully you guys have watched the first video before you came over here and watched this video if not go ahead and click off and go to the first video of first part of this video and then come back right over okay so today like i said we are going to be doing a product review for the upcoming line candy forbidden candy from my homegirl serenity um she is a black powerful young lady yes girl yes boo and you know we gotta support 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 each other so i'm going to be doing a product review today so i am going to be i keep on saying so i'm so sorry guys but i'm going to try to figure out what colors i want to do and then i'm going to come back but I am so happy you guys are back. And if you guys have not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe um subscribe. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell that pops up right next to it if you are not a part of the tribe already. So we're gonna use this the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color fawn. That's what I use to do my um brows, and we're gonna prime our lids with that, okay. So we're just going to go all over. And I think I want to try a new step today. And not go my regular route. I want to just do one eye. And then do the other. So let's see how that works out. Okay. Because I don't really want this to dry too much. I just want it to be tacky enough. That it takes everything. So I'm just blending. Blend in, blend in, pat in, making sure that it's evenly distributed over my eyelids. Over my eyelid, I should say, eyelids. I think I only have two, right? But, okay. Perfect. So while this is still tacky, I am going to go in with my number 7 BH Cosmetic from the BH Cosmetic line Love Affair brush set. And I'm going to go in with a brown. Pray for me. Because my hand ain't so steady, but girl, but girl. 
Let's go. I'm going to fix this line I'm just gonna have to go back in with the foundation the foundation the concealer and conceal and then I'm gonna go back over with the product So, not so bad for my first time doing it. So we're going to go back in with the colors that we went in with before. I'm looking, you know when your brush is like directly in front of you but you can't see it? Okay, there we go. We're going to go back in the yellow. And we're going to clean, go back up on that line where we put the concealer. finished we got a long way to go <laughs> Okay guys, so I'm finished with the eye for now because I have to go under here, but, and I have to do my 
in our crease. But we're gonna do the foundation section. So we are going to use the foundation stick from Forbidden Candy in Warm Yellow. And we're just going to go all in. I don't like a lot of foundation. So we're just gonna do this. But it feels real silky going on the skin. I'm not gonna lie to you, it feels real, real silky. So we're gonna figure out if it's full coverage because that's one thing she wanna know as well. All right, so we're finished with that. I'm gonna go on with my brush. I bought this one. It's the SB Small SB Mall but um face flash flat angle brush from a collection that I bought off of Amazon a few months ago. We're just gonna go in with that brush and we're going to spread the product. Sorry, I was blocking you guys just now. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys, like this bad boy feels so silky and it moves lightly. It moves, it doesn't take a lot to move to push the product around it doesn't it's full coverage as you can see because I don't see any more flaws and I'm going down on my neck because my neck has become darker because of my pregnancy it's full coverage very full coverage I'm gonna go on with a little bit more under my eye Under my eye. Yeah. I don't need it anywhere else. I like this. It's it's very silky. And like I said, it's not hard to push the product around at all. It's not hard to push the product around. I'm going to keep on saying that because some, it it takes a lot sometimes to push foundation around. And like I said, it's very, very lightweight and it's full coverage. I like it. And I was going to start switching to using foundation, um, foundation again. So this looks like my go-to foundation. Thank you, girls. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm just blending, guys, because I like to blend, so don't mind me. It's really full coverage, as you guys can see. No flaws. All right, so after that, we are going to go in with our LA Girl Pro Concealer in a ton of little colors right now. In the color fawn, and guys, just to let you know, this blue brush that I'm using, it's actually a legit paintbrush. So I use it to clean up. I use it to clean up my brows. And because I don't want too much product, I'm using it to lay the concealer exactly, exactly where I want it to be. So it's like painting, literally painting on my face. Literally painting on my face. And 
and it's not a lot of product very lightweight but I'm gonna fast forward this because you guys know how I apply my how I do my contour I just wanted to show you guys the foundation and how light it is so I'll see you guys in a few okay guys so I'm finished with the contour section of my face now I'm gonna go in with the color in warm yellow from Forbidden Candy collection and we are going to go in and set our face set 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 our face if I could find a brush that I was using all right so setting our face that one is a tad bit too warm so I'm actually probably going to use this as a foundation powder so it's it's heavy though I can tell you that it's heavy so it seems to be a good product for this I'm just going to use my black radiant but that one is a little bit too dark to set my face with going to do the under eyes okay guys so for the corner of my eye I am going to go in with the forbidden candy highlight and pencil and I'm gonna go in with the champagne side
I'm gonna have to go back in and fix that. I'm just using my finger to push the product around. I'm gonna come in with a brush and push that around. I'm just gonna use my finger. Okay, Candy. All right, Serenity. Okay, okay. Guys, I'm literally just using my finger to push these product around. That's how creamy it is. That's how creamy it is. So that's the can Forbidden Candy highlighter in the color Champagne. And I just literally use my finger to push the color, the product around. Literally. Now I'm about to go in with a little bit of brush, blush. I don't know where I did with my blush. Where did I do with my blush? Alright, since I can't find my blush, I'm just going to go in here and pick up some color. Some color. Girl, come through highlight. Come through, okay. Highlight you, okay. So, guys, as you see, I'm packing on the blush, but as I pack on the blush, the highlight is like legit popping. Popping, okay. Come through. So, I believe there shall be a part three to this, which is going to be the lips. So, I'll see you guys in a few. My head look crazy. But, when we do this part three, hunty, mm, I'm feeling myself. Still got some kinks to work out. Like I said, I always say, I am not anyone's. Sorry, that got faded. Anyone, by any chance, makeup artist. So, this is just me doing, doing what I do. For the pleasure of doing it for myself. And I am promoting a wonderful friend of mine's product. And it is what it is. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you have not subscribed already, go ahead and please subscribe and become a part of the tribe over here, the SBG Inc. family. We are all about love and support. So I hope you guys do click that note, um, that subscription button and also click the post notification bell that comes next to the subscription button to become part of this family. And we have so much more in store for you guys. So much, so much, so much more in store for you guys. So, I'll see you guys in the next video, which is part three of this. Which is the lip, the lip section, because this video is long already. Very long, I can tell. But, see you guys later.